Oh, yeah, we're going to party, baby. Oh, yeah. This is a gentleman who made his name way back in the day. He's playing around the streets in New Orleans and recorded for the legendary Folkways label, Imperial, Bluesville. He's on so many different labels. All his records are collector's items. He's now come back on the Blacktop record label. He's got one out called Baby Get Your Gun, and it's a good one. And he's got another one that's on the way in July called Out of Nowhere. I'm talking about Snooks Eaglin, influence on Jimi Hendrix and just about everybody that ever picked up the electric guitar and tried to look good. Uh, I'm about to introduce the band. Can we bring the band on? These are some all-stars from New Orleans. A gentleman who's making his name as a, one of the young piano players coming up. From, uh, came over from England. What are we doing? Oh, okay, we're going to save the band for a minute. <laughs> we set them all up, but you got to hold up. Right now, we're going to keep it mellow for a minute and bring back Alan Toussaint and Dr. John and Snooks. Ready to do it. Test. Give me a little more microphone, babe. Test. Yeah. Did, did I say that they were just about ready to do it? Just about. Uh, they sh and, and when they really? when this set is completed, they will go right into another set uh, with some all stars. Mm -hmm. So yeah. it's Snooks kind of, will stay. Snooks will stay on, and then uh, the all stars will join them. So uh, it's kind of a continuous stars, music set. Folks. We're ready now. Here we go. A very good friend of mine that I had a pleasure going to school with. Mr. John Hart, if he's in present, tend to come on up and listen, because there's going to be some fire going on. He with the Rock and Doopsy Band. I'm glad to see you with somebody at least. There you go. Who well, used to practice in the schoolyard and he took my instruments, so I said, well, let me get the hell out of here. This ain't for me. All right. Where the drum at? There's a trio? All right.
Every time I kiss somebody new Make me leave that is you, baby You know I got my foolish right, baby Love that is you, yeah Each night seems like a thousand years old I can't lose these young boys Every time I kiss somebody new Jump the gun, cause it's the man, it's the man that knows all about that. His album on Blacktop Rap called Baby Get Your Gun. He's fixing to drop the bomb on y'all. On keyboards, Mr. John King Cleary. On bass, on loan from the Fast Domino band, Mr. Irvin Charles. One of the best drummers they got in New Orleans, where they got the best drummers they got. Mr. Johnny Vodakovich on the pots. And the man himself, Snoots Ford Eagland. Y'all ready? Do it to him, baby. Man, my red bean is cooking. My red bean cooking. You know my red bean is cooking. Well, my red bean is cooking, yeah. Well, my red bean is cooking. When it get down, I'm gonna 
you look all so sad
Is y'all ready to drop the bomb? All right.
怪呢。
What's that? Wait, wait, wait a minute. One at a time. One at a time, y'all. Oh, I know. I know. You don't say nothing. Do a shot with you. It's your thing, y'all. Do what you want. I can't tell you. Do a shot with you. If you want me to love you, then maybe I will. Tell me, baby. It ain't no big deal, y'all. It's your thing. Do what you want to do.
did You tell my truth the truth I don't need nobody To tell my truth the truth You're 
Who's going to have a few words with us? Snooks, where did the name Snooks come from? Well, it comes from a radio program called Baby Snooks. That's way back in the 40s. What, what kind of a character was Baby Snooks? He was on Little Rascals. Uh, did, did, did that name have anything to do with your behavior? Oh, no. 
You, you weren't a rascal either, huh? Uh-uh. <laughs> what, what is your real name, by the way? Well, I prefer Snoots. Okay, we'll let it go with that. How would you classify your music? Do you call it blues, call it R&B? What, what do you call it specifically, if anything? Well, the music that I play is just normal blues, just like what any other artist would perform with, you know, and feel like you have the blues, you play the blues, you sleep with the blues, and eat with the blues. Sometimes we see you recording with full bands, other times we see you recording by yourself or one other person. I guess that's what's so confusing. Well, it is confusing during that time. Doing a session by yourself was like sitting at home doing nothing, to tell you the truth. But with a band, you have more experience. You know, you get the feeling. It, mostly when you do a session by yourself, with no band, it's like a test pattern, bro, like you do on TV. Fly something across the screen and you don't worry about it after that. So I take it you prefer to record with the band? Yeah, like Blacktop, I've been doing things with them so far, and everything I did with them was real beautiful, bro, all the way around. Okay, thank you for taking the time to stop by and chat with us. Snook Siegland. And thank you.